peace and love to everybody out there. I just wanted to drop some information real quick. So, I have been trying to do the vegan thing or vegetarian. I'm not sure, the vegetable thing. <laughs> I've been trying to do that for the last past two weeks. And, and it's been going pretty good. It's actually not that bad. It's actually not that hard. I suggest people, you know, get into it. But the reason, but my reason is probably different than other people's reasons. But so a while back, there was this interview on CNN. I want to say CNN. I don't know. One of, one of the news networks. The guy, one with the old guy with the different little lights and stuff in the background. And then dude was at his desk. And it was him having a conversation with this other guy. Jewish guy to be exact. So the guy was in there telling uh, him that basically what they do is they, uh, what, I'm trying to think, how did he say it? I haven't heard it in, a, it's been about a couple of years, a year or two. So, because I'm, at, first, at first I didn't, I didn't really believe it, you know, but it's probably been, yeah, it's been about a year or two. But, uh, so when it comes down to me, if you sit back and really think about it, there is not enough cows and there are not enough chickens to supply the whole world every day. So what he was explaining was that they, he said that they would uh, drain the blood of the enemy, which has you, has you have to think, who is the enemy? You know what I mean? He says he drained the blood of the enemy and the, the CNN dude was like, so what, so y'all eat the meat? And he was like, no, we're not cannibals. What we do is we take the meat and send it to Europe or they do it in Europe. I'm not exactly sure what, what the, the, the think was exactly. But basically, he says they ground the meat up and they send it to all of these um, restaurants and grocery stores. And think about what that meat is. You might not want to mess with it too much anymore. But basically, that's what he said they do. He was like, that's why all the dollar menu items are so cheap. That's why they, he was like, do you think we could really afford to just put everything for a dollar or these things are so cheap so I wouldn't and I'm not just saying the dollar menu items on places I'm just saying in general like yeah I heard that and I really thought about that and sat and thought about that and personally like since I heard that I don't too much really care for meat no more because ain't no telling what it is outside of the the cloning stuff they do outside of the the 3d printing meat which that's actually it interesting thing to look at not saying like go do it but i'm saying it's interesting to watch but uh yeah so uh it's been a great day <laughs> absolutely <laughs>